Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is BTD and welcome to something a little bit different. Now, if you guys remember, my channel is mostly grown from Minecraft story mode. Now, if you've watched a couple of my more recent videos, not the latest, but it's one of the recent ones, you would know that Telltale have shut down their offices and their company, seeing as they can't afford to keep everybody on. So that obviously means we're not going to get any more Minecraft story mode. Now, I was doing some scrolling through Netflix, you know, and it's a bit bored gonna watch something and I came across Minecraft story mode and I'm thinking how the hell does that work and then I realized that it plays through the whole of the game but you can actually interact with it on Netflix and I thought this is a bit weird so what I thought was I make a quick video just sort of get my thoughts across on this so as you know I played Minecraft story mode I played every single episode on this channel you can go back and watch them uh, and I'm not sure if I have a playlist of them or not but yeah, you'll find them, because I did a whole batch of them at the exact same time. Um, and I feel now it's just a bit boring. Why would somebody want to play like that on Netflix? Seeing as we came from the whole uh, PC and then we went to Xbox and PS4, I believe, that you play as Jesse and blah, 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 blah. And now I sort of feel like they're sort of expanding it to make a bit more money off of it. And I, I'm not a fan when company does that. Like, yeah, obviously you got to make money, but... Just keep at your roots, you know, because those roots were great. Well, I think we finished off the season very well with Minecraft Story Mode, and the fact it's on Netflix now is a bit odd. And, yeah, so what I think we're going to do, guys, is have a quick reaction to this uh, video and take it from there. So, yeah, uh, I'll clip over to me now watching it, and, yeah, we'll take it from there. Right, so here we are. We are about to watch the trailer. I don't know what to expect. Will it be the exact same as before? I don't know. So, let's do it. Yeah. I believe this is back season one. Yep, because of the cringy jump thing. You can see the subtitles are a lot more different, and this is where it got me. That's where it got me when I first was watching a few clips of this. An interactive adventure. Now, this means that they're bringing the availability for people that have Netflix to play along like we did back on the PC, so which I actually find is actually quite cool compared to everything else that I've slated. So yeah, let's continue. Obviously. Oh, he's going to get your ass. Petra, there's Petra, my girl. Hell yeah. One thing I've noticed, guys, I'll even play it through here, that the animations on, uh, can I go back? Let's go back and just go to this bit here. The animations for, like, the sword and the bow and things like that, they're a lot more high-tech for Netflix, which I think is actually quite cool. But we never got that on PC, which I find really annoying, seeing as we have the more hardware power to be able to run, like, different animations like this. But for some reason, uh, Telltale thought, nah, you're not having that bun off and I was like I and yeah we went from there so yeah a few little different things we've got in here compared to the Netflix one as you can see at the bottom here uh, I believe I can talk about my mouse right there uh, it's like a little remote thing for um, well yeah your remote so you'll be able to like put in the uh, correct symbols and things like that for the crafting table which I think is actually quite cool and yeah I'm, I'm blabbering on a bit so let's carry on Hell yeah, we can change all kinds of stuff. Probably. Lucas, Lucas. The graphics are so cool. Yeah, there you go. We've now you can see the uh, new animations as well, like the little uh, boxes for like the follow Gabriel and help Lucas. They're all different now, and I think they should look a lot better. I just uh, I'm just so annoyed that we didn't have that you know, on, on the PC version. The gauntlet will guide you. Man, this brings back so many memories. I used to love this. Such a shame they're not bringing this back. But yeah, there we are, guys. Minecraft story mode. An interactive adventure. So yeah, that's it. I believe that is it. Let me have a quick look. 
Oh yeah, that's season two, I believe. Just like we we all know that if you watched it, if you haven't, go back and watch my stuff. But yeah, um, let me guys, let me guys, let me know in down in the comment section down below what you guys think about the whole Netflix series. Like, you'll be able to sit on your couch and just use a remote to play Minecraft Story Mode, or do you guys think that it's a bad thing and they should just keep it on PC? So I sort of I'm middleman. Like I've had my pros and my cons. And yeah, this is why I just, just wanted to make a quick little video and reaction as well. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you have, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button if you're new around here for gaming videos uh, whenever I do. Hopefully at least once a week. <laughs> but yeah, um, hope you've enjoyed. Leave a comment down below if you have disliked it and tell me why. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. We are lost. <laughs>